You can easily configure which shell is used in VS Code's integrated terminal. On Windows, this is useful if you want to switch between using Command Prompt and PowerShell or Git Batch, for example. And on Mac and Linux, this is useful if you want to switch between Bash and Z Shell or any of the other available shells. To do this, I'm going to first create a new integrated terminal here, so new terminal. And you can see I'm using PowerShell at the moment, but if I go into this drop down here, I can say select default shell. And here I have a list of available shells here. And this is just a pre-populated list. Um, and I'm going to say, let's use command prompt instead. So I'll just select this one. My current shell is unchanged, but as soon as I create a new shell here, now you can see that it is using command prompt. And we could set it to git batch or anything else as well. So all new shells will now use command prompt. Now over on Mac, for example, I can uh, do the same thing. Just create a new terminal. See, I'm using Z shell by default. Say select default shell, and I go to bash. Now when I create a new shell, it's using bash instead. So and easily switch between things. Now this is also backed by a setting. So if I go and I open my settings here, and I go to my uh, settings JSON file, you can see that in both cases, um, for both Windows and Mac OS, there's actually a setting that is backing this. So if you had a um, shell that was at a non-standard uh, location, or you're wanting to use a more specialized shell, you can just put this full path into the settings here, based on whatever platform you're on, and VS Code will pick those up. So that's how you can configure the shell that is used in VS Code's integrated terminal.